right, here we are at our uh, newly built bachelor mansion, built by yours truly. Um, this is the first episode of my new bachelor challenge, featuring none other than our glorious hunk, hello, Michael Myers. He's ready with his knife, he's ready with his Nikes, and his colorful socks, and his pumpkins. He's ready to find love. Being a ser serial killer is a, a pretty lonely job, if you want to call it a job. <laughs> well, it's his job, so yeah. Anyway, um, yes, we are here for the first episode of The Bachelor. We have seven girls competing for the love of Michael Myers. Um, there's a little bit of a twist to this Bachelor series compared to other Bachelor series that I've done in the past. At the end of the night, when an elimination takes place, good old Michael Myers here is not only going to eliminate them from the competition, he's also going to eliminate them from life. With our uh, extreme violence mod, that will be completely possible. So each time one of these girls is eliminated, they are also going to be murdered. And where that is going to take place is in our secret dungeon down here. <laughs> they built a little jail cell to, you know, put the person in with a toilet so they can take a poo one last time before they're killed. Um, and all of their glorious portraits are on this wall so he can come down and you know, look over the portraits before he makes his final decision on who he wants to eliminate. Um, yeah, so this first episode is going to include just a quick little tour of the house and a little introduction on the girls. Um, this one right here is actually me. <laughs> I showed up in my wedding dress. Everyone knows how much I love Michael Myers, so of course I had to put my sim self into this competition. So yes, here we go. A little quick tour of the house before I hit play. We have our little entryway here. Nothing fancy. I actually got kind of lazy near the end of this build. It was such a big house to build for me that I kind of just wanted to get it done with. One little portrait in this hallway here. Our glorious kitchen where we'll be having a ton of fun little family dinners together. We have a, a little bar, a little fish tank little wine cooler here. I made the bathrooms pretty much able to have everyone go in them at once. It would be total chaos if seven girls were trying to use a bathroom and they would yell at each other each time. So I made little stalls and showers. Kitchen leads into a pool. An in-ground indoor pool with some yoga mats and uh, meditation mats so they can, you know, get their relaxation on before they, you know, worry about being murdered. Um, yeah. So anyway, we have this little outdoor area with a cute little tent. If you want to call this a tent, I don't know. But I really like this table in the little centerpiece. I was very fond of that. So... You come down these stairs and we have another pool with a little diving board and a pizza floaty so they can have fun in the water. Gets your relaxation on over here and a little area for two people to just converse. Ah. <laughs> so yes, moving upstairs, we have a, what do we have? Another little sitting area, nothing too crazy. A couple little couches here to sit and relax. Another little bar upstairs, and this is the girls' room. I put all of their beds as singles because they won't sleep together if they're not friends, and I have a feeling that there's going to be a lot of drama with all of these girls chasing the same guy. So I gave them a little couch, beds with their portraits hanging up above their bed so I remember who goes where. Little workout area, hookah, you know, some stuff to entertain themselves. This is their little getting ready room. We have a, a stripper pole <laughs> so they can practice their moves. Um, you know, little poofs to get ready, a bunch of mirrors, some makeup, their own little bathroom here. Let's see, what else is there? Oh, this is the sitting area where they're all going to get together and have their, what is this? What is that? 
Oh, pieces from the floor below. Okay. Um, they're all going to sit and mingle and blah, blah, blah. Kind of have a party area here with a DJ booth, a dance floor, hot tub. Just some more fun stuff for the girls to do since they're pretty much going to be confined to this mansion except for when they go on dates. We have the elimination room here with a little photo studio. I put these little teleporters here so I'll be able to teleport them to their spots easily. We have the little bachelor rose. It's ready to go. So cute. I was really excited about that. And this is our bachelor suite with another stripper pole. <laughs> so if the girls are ever invited here, um, they'll be able to show off their moves for good old Nike. He has his own little bathroom here and a little closet, nice little bed. And he has his own private um, patio with fun stuff to do for when he invites the girls to hang out with him. They can play ping pong, go in the hot tub. She can uh, show off her cooking skills and cook him a nice little barbecued meal. They can sit down and snuggle together, smoke some hookah. There's just a bunch of stuff to do. Um, I added a wishing well. I don't even know what this does, honestly, but I'm going to find out. Make a wish. Wish for romance. Hey, I can have all of the girls wish for romance and then see if anything happens. And then we have a little fountain here um, from the Romantic Garden Pack where I honestly don't know what this does, but I'm going to turn it on. <laughs> so yeah, anyway, that is the Bachelor Mansion. And now... This, the rest of this first episode is going to consist of the girls um, kind of just I'm kind of going to just let them go and do whatever they want. Um, they're going to mingle with him and we'll see what happens. No elimination in this first episode because there's no dates. I'm going to try to keep this episode short and just kind of see what happens for the first day. Um, yeah, so here we go. Let's push play. Oh, God. Already, everyone has to pee, and everyone's miserable. Hello. Oh, God. <gasps> she has jizz on her face. I totally forgot that when I set up this game, and I had to, um, <laughs> I had to have all the girls take each other's portraits to put in the murder room. This girl and Michael already did the dirty already before I even started the challenge so I had to go in and reset all of the relationships but I guess it didn't get the the stuff off of her face and everyone's shocked they're all like what the hell okay well she's going and he is just up here doing the most what are you doing up here <laughs> he is so ready okay girls what's everyone gonna gonna do everyone seems so miserable you can leave now like you can go inside put your phone away there's no phones allowed at the bachelor mansion what is this cereal you're in this gorgeous mansion and you're eating there's a fire where's the fire what the <laughs> okay we've literally been playing for two seconds Hold on, hold on. Attractiveness alert. Chanel Elmore just stopped what they were thinking about for a moment and found themselves staring at Michael Myers. Okay, so Chanel is attracted to Michael and and he's attracted to her too. Uh-oh. Well, that's not a surprise, honestly. Okay, someone please do something. Call the fire department, please. Michael. Oh shit. Christine taking the initiative to put out the fire. Oh, that's great. All right, well, I guess we didn't need the fire department. Everyone run inside. All right, and just like that, everyone is back outside. Chanel and Adeline are just freaking out. Okay, can we all hang out now? Let's friendly introduction with everyone, or flirty introduction with everyone, to see if there's any romance that's gonna spark up. Where's Christine? And Haley? Christine? 
<laughs> she put out the fire and now she's like, I really have to pee, so she's gonna go do that. The firefighters are on their way. Um, a little bit too late. Hello. Nice to meet you. This is completely normal. The firefighter is like, why did I even come here? <gasps> they think we pranked him. They're charging me 500 simoleons because of... Because Christine put out the fire. Okay, calm down, Lindsay. It's over. Oh, practicing the dance moves. What is up with her hands? Who are you calling? <gasps> She just pee? <gasps> she just peed. Have a Sims bladder fail a lot with five or more toilets. There are more than five toilets here and you pissed yourself. Oh, Lindsay, you're not off to a good start. Let's get you a shower. <laughs> Madeline's just following him. She looks so miserable. Everyone looks miserable. Oh, hey. Where am I going? Lindsay acquired the cooking skill. Oh my god, everyone is still in their formal gowns and she's just wearing a hoodie and jeans. Alright, I have to get each of them to get him over here to talk. Rough day, honey. I know. I know. Is he on his way? There. Oh, okay. <laughs> she just dipped the second that he offered Rose. Hello. That's his job. Oh, we're going to have each girl get to know him a little bit. And see how that goes. She has... She's ignoring my request. Okay, well, your turn is up then, I guess. <laughs> Be flattering. Is he wearing a wedding ring already? It looked like it. <laughs> Michael Myers shows signs of the lover personality archetype. Okay, well, he uh, is very tense because of the fire. And he's getting sleepy, so everyone's going to have to, like, get up and go chat with him. It is so hard to get eight sims to do what you want them to do. Oh my god, you know what? Just dance. You dance, and you dance. Everyone sit down. Where did they go? <gasps> He's coming up in his boxers. Oh my God. No. What is he doing? It's the first night. All right, Haley's the only one who stayed. So we're just gonna chat with her a little bit. Get to know Haley. Miss, oh, she still hasn't even met him, Christine. Oh, hey. Is there anyone who hasn't met him yet? Let's see. Has Adrian met him? Ooh, he's attracted to Christine as well. So, so far he's had attraction alerts to Christine and um, Chanel. So those two are going to be, so far, going on the group date tomorrow. I'm going to take four of the girls on a group date. And the three, the other three are just going to have to stay home. Ooh, look how she's looking at him. She's like, hey, daddy. <laughs> Wait, is she flirting with Haley? She's like, hey, come sit down. There we go. Sit down. On Facebook, um, when I posted the picture of the girls, someone said that 
Christine has the Karen haircut. The I would like to speak to a manager haircut. So we'll see if she has that personality. <laughs> But yeah, at this point, everyone has met Michael. He has at least said hello to all the girls. And things seem to be going well other than the fire <laughs> that started. Ooh. Ooh, what's he doing? He's flirting. He's flirting with Haley. Haley, go steal him away. She is dipping. All right. She's going to go for it. He loved it. Oh, he loved it. All right, so after a fun little evening of kind of getting to know each other, I'm going to send all of the girls to bed. Who is this here? It's going to take a minute to get all of them to bed because they are all in the wrong beds. Of course. What am I doing? Two o'clock in the morning and I'm eating a grilled cheese. Of course, that is totally something I would do in real life. Oh, wait. We're going to have Chanel kiss Michael's hands before she goes to bed since they had a little bit of uh, a romantic connection immediately. Hello, honey. Let's see. If <gasps> he didn't like it. Oh, he didn't like it. That's not good. <laughs> Still can't get over that. She needs to go take a shower. Okay, apologize to him real quick. Apologize and then go to bed. Maybe he's mad that she still has the jizz. He might be upset. He's probably like, what is wrong with you? It's been like a whole day and you still haven't taken a shower. You are gross. So take a shower, Chanel, and then please get in bed. Everyone go to bed so we can move on to this next day. <laughs> Someone is sleep talking. I wouldn't be surprised if it's me because I sleep talk in real life. Who is it? Okay, well, everyone is sound asleep now. Um, that concludes our very first quick little episode just to be able to meet the girls and see what happens on their first night. Uh, Michael had a couple of different attraction alerts for Chanel and Christine. So I'm curious to see how the group date is going to go tomorrow with uh, Chanel, Christine, and the other two that I randomly pick. And um, especially since Chanel tried to kiss his hands and he rejected it. So I don't know how this is going to end up tomorrow, but after our first group date in the next episode, there will be the very first elimination. So I'm very excited to see how this goes. Um, I'm not sure yet if I want to take them somewhere for the date or if I want them to just stay here. Um, I'll probably end up taking them somewhere so they can be separated from the other girls so they won't intervene. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching the very first uh, Sims 4 Bachelor Michael Myers episode. And yeah, stay tuned for the next one. Thanks, you guys. Bye-bye.